Yo, what is going on, my fellow sea serpents? We are playing the game called The Council. Uh, it just jump scared the shit out of me for this guy's fucking disgusting Abraham Lincoln ass face. But anyway, let's just jump right on into it. France. Oh, oh wee oui, wee, oui, me. Paris. Yo, who was in Paris? <laughs> December 10th, 1792. What is going on? <clears throat> Stop! You're not getting anywhere with this Von Borschert. You know, I kind of get the same feeling, my dear Sarah. But <laughs> look at her face! Listen. Nothing. Not a sound. Man, I didn't know Francis no was crackheads. Like, what the fuck? That's what you In think. In 1792. The Golden Order knows exactly where we are. <laughs> By the so time these your are, this is who was in Paris. Turns up, I'll be long gone. As for you, nothing will remain of your body. If She's gonna you die touch like two a single hair in my mother's head, I'll skin you alive. <laughs> I oh, have no intention of beating threat? your dear mother. There are more persuasive ways of making you talk. Arsenic? In all these? This is Brazil on it. I intend to get no, back. this is Basil. <laughs> you are going to Brazil. Where have you hidden it? Von Borchert. You can't sell that book on the black market anymore. This is finished. We know yeah, you're planning on selling at one of Lord Mortimer's parties. All right? Just tell us who the buyer is and we can make a deal. You've no idea of the trouble you've gotten yourselves into. Yes. Oh, you will tell These me guys don't even hidden. sound like they're French. I can promise you that. Oh, stop annoying our host, Louis. Oh, Son, okay. Didn't what happened to you in Rome teach you What anything? happened to him in Rome? He got fucked. Just a few more minutes and my concoction will be ready. His car? With this, your bodies will dissolve in less than four hours. You'll see. It loosens tongues in no time. You know? I can't do anything. I have to admit, way. Mother, the only thing you've ever taught me is that damn motto of yours. Always remain rational and open. I got it. I've opened our shackles. Draw him over Dang, here. Damn, she's not even here. Bombarchard. Bombarchard. Hmm. What? He didn't even whisper Listen. that. Let's make a deal. I'll tell you where the book is if you let my mother go free. Oh, what are you playing at? Don't worry, mother. You want to play the hero. Pity you're not in any position to do so. What? For the last time. Where is Alazif? Let me do this. Trust me. She, uh, what is she gonna do? She's old. All right, fuck it. Please, be my guest, mother. Mm. Uh. Damn! Straight savage. Oh, what the fuck? I'm gonna help. shoot him. There's no ammo in it, is there? Uh. Damn! Well okay. done, Louis. You reacted perfectly. How do you feel, mother? <laughs> Lipstick so off. He's alive, so I can question him after we get back. Pity he's just a middleman. Hmm. Means I haven't finished with this case. Oh, I had a feeling you'd be running off on one of your adventures again, mother. You know what? I'm warning you. <laughs> this time, I'm coming acting. with you. No. Even though you impress me more and more, I have to do this on my own. How is mother, she still alive? She you're no spring chicken die. anymore. Yeah, I know, right? On, she looks like she's about to on. die. And don't forget to send our men to tend to Von Borchardt. Okay. What am I even playing? One month later. Alright, we got a time skip. January 20th, 1793. Yo, they were turning up in uh, 1793. Lord. Baltimore's island off the coast of England. Well done, mother. 
You just had to pick up Bob Burchard's trail on your own, didn't you? You ditch me in Paris with no explanation, and off you go to infiltrate one of the world-renowned receptions of this Lord Mortimer? And now he writes me to say that you've gone missing on his private island? Which, by the way, looks more like a big rock than a paradise island. What is my main character's voice acting, yo? The least he could do is explain to me how he managed to lose you. Oh, case, who is it's that? It's time for you to stop all this, mother. It no longer suits your age. Well, I'm sure I'll find you once again, slogging through the caves beneath the island, searching for some long lost mystical object that you just can't live without. I'm already hating this trip, and all I've done is think about it. What one may be able to imagine, it was not the host himself who invited me. Well now, Duchess. <laughs> what is his face? Both invited by Sir Holm. Well, how very amusing. Damn, Perhaps she got a nice pair of eyes. eyes. Is this your first time at one of Lord Mortimer's legendary parties? Oh my parties? god. Oh no, we have been friends since long ago. But as I'm doing some business with Sir Holm, the, the invitation so came she from him. got a nice pair of eyes too. Well, I simply can't wait for all the festivities to begin. And you good, sir. Oh my what god. brings you here? Um... Eh, first Your Eminence, order. with all due respect, I prefer to keep my reasons for coming here to myself. I promise it has nothing to do with the legendary party that you all appear to be preparing for. I believe what you will, my son. However, everything is related to the legendary parties organized by the our legendary hopes. parties. Yeah, I'll be the judge of that, Cardinal. Okay, anyway, cool, consider yourself. yourself fortunate, young man. Because there are many who dream of simply one day setting foot on this island. And only a very few ever make it. And I don't give Indeed, a fuck. Indeed, I imagine this must be your first time here. And you, Duchess? You seem to be quite accustomed to things here. Am I right? I do not think that one can ever get accustomed to what Lord Mortimer prepares for his guests. What the fuck? But you are right. This is not the first time I've been on this wharf. Okay, so we if follow her. Come back again. For I imagine you must find it to reasons. be of some interest. Here, everything is possible if you make the right choices. It really is up to you whether you leave better off or not. Please excuse me if you find me overly curious, young man. I did not mean to cause you any embarrassment. Come, Duchess. They are waiting for you. I just ignored you. We're moving, Monsieur de Richet, if you would like to join us. I'm coming, Duchess. I'd like to join you, all right? A Duchess? I wonder if all the guests here are this prestigious. I thought you were going to say if pretentious. I'd known, I, I would have gone for a better suit. What the fuck? Are you alright? I'm having visions. Oh no, I'm about to do the Harlem Shake. No! In. 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 In early 2016, there'll be a reaction YouTuber known as Jinx. <gasps> no, not Jinx. Mother? Oh shit, your hand. What the fuck? What? So? Okay, it's done. Did you put it in a safe place? Yes. I made sure no one was following me. Don't worry, Sarah, no one's going to find it. Why is she missing her fucking hand? Are you hand? absolutely sure? Yes, I'm sure. Right. Just one thing left to do. No, mother! No! Don't! Don't! What? Have you lost your mind? There is no other way. If you... if you kill me, you won't find it. That is the point, my dear. No one must ever put their hands on it again. She found the no. fucking Book of Cthulhu. But... I trusted you. No, Sarah. Don't. No. Who the fuck is this douchebag? No. <gasps> you can run if you want to, Sarah, but you will pay. <sighs> oh, that's gonna happen in the future. <sighs> you. Uh, Louis, are you right? What's going on? Here, take this. <laughs> it's, it's, he looked down, he got a nosebleed like I'm Master sorry. Roshi. Keep it. Are you better? He's like, oh! I'm fine. Don't worry. 
It's getting late. Why don't why don't you go on ahead and I'll catch up with you, okay? Are you sure? Yes. I'm I'm sorry. I'm sure yes. Fine. Fine. So we're gonna have to. So we have visions I from the future. I definitely have to find mother quickly. Am I going crazy or, or Whoa, what? Whoa! We actually this get to play the game. The, the Duchess arrived with me. What's happening to me, for God's sake? That was a premonition of Absolutely the future. Absolutely to find you, mother. Oh, what? <laughs> what? It's one animation. Louis, during the trip, I had something I wanted to ask you, but we didn't happen to run into each other. Yes, Duchess? I'm gonna trust I'm not her. not sure if you remember, movies. but we've met before. At that time, you were of two minds as to your choice of career. Tell me, what have you been up to since? Oh, I get to pick my skills in this game? Oh, I'm a detective. Yeah. Well, over the last few years, I've solved a number of crime cases. Like the chauffeur d'Angers, for example. Thieves that tortured their victims with burning embers. Hmm, charming. How did you catch them? I told the most cowardly one that the others had given him up. Ah, and I wager your thief suddenly started to talk. You wouldn't believe it. He told us everything. The jobs, the stashes, the names of his partners. <laughs> Couldn't shut him up. I heard about that case, but I didn't know you were the one who solved it. I'm flattered that the news made it across the channel. And you've got a darn good memory, Duchess. Well, they say I have the memory of two people. But please, call me Emily. Oh, I will, Fine, Emily. Emily. Tell me, I was actually helped on that case by my mother. You wouldn't know her by any chance. Wait, Louis. We've already met. You do remember me, don't you? Not at all, so I don't know. Please excuse me, madam. I'm sure we've met before, but I don't remember where. That's hmm. fine, be honest. I dude. appreciate your honesty, even if it's not very flattering for me. I imagine that with your beauty, madam, it's the first time a man hasn't remembered your face. Damn, well, my man's trying to get himself. You make up for yourself rather elegantly. Please stop torching me. I'm completely at your mercy. Where have we met? Where have Four we years met? Ago, in London? <gasps> in no, Paris? Sorry, I, I don't Where remember. Where were they? In the Who was there? Of William Pitt. Remember? No? <laughs> I'm so sorry, Emily, but I really don't remember you. Let's drop it, Louis. It doesn't matter. Right, time to go to the manor. Opportunities. Your skills allow you to discover hidden details, select the opportunity. Object that is most suggestive of the situation in order to discover them. Okay. Bruh. Oh, I see. I ask her a question, she answers with another. Is she playing with me? Person, each person email on island has their own personality, which speaks so vulnerable to certain skills and immune to others. Okay. Emily, please excuse my insisting, but you still haven't answered about my mother. Do you know her? You'll see, Louis. Everybody here knows Sarah de Richet. I don't know where we're going like this, Emily, but you're connected to my mother one way or another. And if I can believe my vision, you don't have much of a place in her heart. But I'm trying to make her have a place in my heart, shit. Ain't no mama's boy. <laughs> Alright, this is the simp simulator. Who the fuck is this dude? May I ask your name, please? Balls. Louis Moras de Richet. Monsieur de Richet. Delighted to welcome you. <gasps> Among us! Sir. You must Among be Sarah de Richet's son. I must tell you, we are doing our <laughs> oh my God. to find your mother as quickly as possible. How do you know where is Lord? I have an Mortimer? appointment with Lord Mortimer. Would you be so kind as to lead me to him? Unfortunately, sir, I cannot. I don't know exactly where my master is. But rest assured, sir, everyone is waiting for you at the manor. Why sir specifically Holm me, insists on Mr. Eyeliner Wilson. Man? Since your mother went missing. Everyone has been concerned oh, about Shit, fighting. I'm wearing eyeliner Who too. Who is Sir Holm? A close friend of Lord Mortimer's. Please, rest assured, sir, it won't take us long to find your revered mother. Indeed, we are searching the caves again because lights were seen at the wharf just last night. The wharf? Where we are now? Indeed, sir. According Jesus. to our information, lights were seen in the middle of the night, sir. After in the middle of the night. None of the guests seem to have oh, left the manor last night. Oh, no. We think that perhaps Sarah's God mother damn, was I don't there. give a shit. Shut the fuck up. 
Have you found anyone? And did you find anything then? We discovered a certain amount of damage, okay. sir, on the wooden part of the wharf. What type of damage? Broken barrels, mainly. We'll do whatever is necessary to have them rapidly repaired. But quite frankly, I can't imagine what Sir's mother would have been doing with them. What could Mother have been doing with barrels? I don't give a shit about this old our hag. our search of the wharf hasn't been entirely unsuccessful, though. What do you mean? What do you mean? We seem to have found an object <gasps> that would appear to belong to Sir's mother. A handkerchief. Oh, a, a handkerchief, handkerchief is embroidered with the initials S. DR. Isn't that the we same one that the Chick gave us to? They are the initials of Sir's mother, Sarah de Richet. It's totally not. I have orders to give it to Lord Mortimer as soon as I see him. I know my mother. She's not the kind to go for a midnight stroll in the wharf for nothing. I've got to find out what the hell she was doing here. Where exactly did you find the handkerchief? On the landing dock, sir. The one you arrived by. What the fuck? You're giving me back. Let's say no more of this. Give me the handkerchief. I'll personally show it to Lord Mortimer. Well, I... I've traveled hard for several days in order to get here. Yes, but... Invited by your master. No, of course, but... Because my mother went missing right under your nose. Sir, please. And I... having only just arrived, you refused to give me her personal belongings? Well, he, he didn't of refuse anything not, else. It but was never my intention to contradict, sir. Here you are. I must return now. Is still oh, much yeah, to prepare yeah. in order to welcome all the guests. Gonna use it as a nut rag. Wait, what? It is indeed your handkerchief, mother. Okay, apparently you it must is. Must come here for a specific reason. I need to know what it I, is. I don't need to know. I don't care. What could she have been doing out here on this wharf? Right, let me pause this for a second. I'll be right back. I gotta take a shit. Holy shit! I was like gone for a head. That was like the worst shit of my life, man. Oh my god. I also came back with, uh, this video was sponsored by Coca-Cola. This video is not sponsored, just a disclaimer. Um, if you think, uh, 157 subscribed YouTube channel that garners only, like, 20 views pretty much gets a Coca-Cola sponsor, you're nuts. Also, I forgot I was playing this game. It's, oh, it's locked. Open the key. Locked. I'll never get it open barehanded. You could just... Pick the lock, I don't have that. I don't, I, I'm not that, uh... You, probably, you could, you could in theory just jump over that fence. Look, hold on. Is it fully fenced around? No, it's not. There's just this door. This is the most useless thing ever. There's just one door, you can literally just jump to the other side. I, what <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> Ooh, is this a weapon? Yo, we got a weapon. Go shove it up our ass. Looks like a bar from an old gate. This miserable old bar has been broken fairly recently. The edges are still clean, and the tip is blackened. Without analysis to the contrary, I put my money on cannon powder. Take the boy. Fuck this it. might just come in handy. Why the fuck would I not? Where the fuck? He shoved that right up his imaginary like ass. Oh! Zeus! No, that's, uh, that's Poseidon. Whoa. Impressive. Poseidon. Yeah, I can ah, tell by his trident. I was looking for you. What can I do for you, your eminence? Your eminence? I wanted to ask you. You are the son of Sad no. de Liche, aren't you? No. You see, your mother and I were supposed to meet here on this very spot. I was supposed to hand her a very important envelope. But I haven't mm -hmm. seen her. If only Mother had told me why she was coming here. Anyway, I ought to take the envelope. It might have something to do with Ten her bucks disappearance. Can't fucking Listen, them. if it will help, you can always confrontation give it to me. Confrontation start. During a confrontation, you have to go through several steps while being as persuasive as possible. Conversations have consequences on the rest of the story, so don't hesitate to use your skills. Okay. Well, thank you, my son. That Just in be mind. honest with him. He seems I'd like he likes that. I'd deal with her directly. Don't take it personally. Would you happen to know if your mother has arrived yet? Yeah, let's... Certainly, your eminence. Mother got here some time ago. I was hoping to find her when I arrived, but given the hour, she must be asleep by now. Right. I shall see her tomorrow, then. By the way, your eminence, I wasn't aware you knew my mother. Ah. 
you only knew my son, I hold oh your Oh my god, take a shot heart. every time to say mom or mother. She has rendered great service to the church. <laughs> Some of this cartoon, <laughs> Looney Tunes, Tom I and Jay music. I hope you will follow in her footsteps. If only she had told me where she was headed. Nonetheless, our exchanges have I'm really always playing been Tom and Jay music. Discreet. I feel like I'm gonna get and chased. I should like them to remain as such. If your mother wishes to speak to you about us one day, I will not mind if she does so. That is very commendable. But since we work together on a daily basis, it's it's surely just an oversight. Most certainly. Uh, you said you work together. What do you do exactly? A business art collector. Uh, we are members of the Golden Order. My mother and I belong to the same secret organization, the Golden Order, which I joined a few years ago. Mother trained me, and I assist in her research. In other words, you can trust me. <laughs> My child, you are telling a perfect stranger that you and your mother work for a secret society. Oh, no. It would seem that discretion is not one of your specialities, my son. You will understand that it does not encourage me to put my trust in you. Damn. All the same, it bothers me to see you in a quandary, your eminence. Is there any other solution? Look, if it's of any help, you can always leave your envelope with me and I'll give it to her as soon as I see her. Uh, I uh, hesitate. Up till now, we have always dealt with her in person, and that has always been successful. Okay. Do you think I should give it to you? Yeah. Listen, you have nothing to fear. I will give your letter to my mother the moment I find her. The moment you find her? You mean Sarah has gone missing? Shit, I shouldn't have said that. What the fuck are you- Let's not exaggerate. I, I don't no know where her room is. I just got here. What do you mean nothing. she's gone missing, you Listen idiot? Me, child. If I give you the letter, can you promise me before God that no one other yeah, than Yeah, yeah, I'm lying. Yeah, I'm lying. We're lying. I swear by the Almighty God to honor the promise that no one but my mother shall cast her gaze upon your letter. Good. Listen, let's stop there. I'm going to tell you a secret. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Success! Blasphemy and going to hell! ...who face a massacre organized by the accursed Republican tribunals. The church is literally being bled like a beast. Without your mother, hundreds of men of the cloth would have gone to the guillotine. Everyone she has made the, the services of your order. Available to us by organizing the priest's safe passage across the borders. Even if she does not share all our convictions, she always provided assistance. Young man, you can be proud to be her son. Be it only for her sake. Always respect your name. Here, the letter I spoke of. It includes a list of about 15 names ready for departure. Be quick. Remember to tell Sarah when you see her. That time is short. Louis, come join us. Monsieur, yeah. may I introduce you to Monseigneur, his eminence, Cardinal Piaggi? He joins us straight from Rome. Oh, just call me your eminence. It's simpler. George Washington, president of the United What States the fuck? America. Delighted at last to make your... <laughs> George Washington and Yo, let's kill him! Mr. President. Pleased to meet you, Mr. President. Louis Moras de Richet. It is an honor to meet you. Young you man, the let's keep it simple, please. Let us forget our fancy time. Alright, alright. If I know anything, if this game is historically accurate, George Washington was a down-to-earth cool dude. We'll see. It will <laughs> come. Despite all the goodwill in the world, you can't stop people scheming left and right around oh, here. Speak for yourself. Not, yeah, exactly. <laughs> what are you talking about? Well, my friends, do any of you know the reason why we're here this time? If you don't mind, Gregory, I should like to keep Mr. Washington company. I would also Please, like to keep him home. company. And you, sir? If I stay with Washington, we'll be able to speak about my mother 
But on the other hand, I'd like to learn more about this home. I don't Some give a vision. fuck about this guy. It's George motherfucking Washington. Let's see what Washington has to say. When did you last speak to her? Philadelphia. Damn. Years ago. Sarah often went back and forth between France and the United States. That's not yes, often at all. I remember those days. I didn't see her too often. Right. Would it be too much if I asked you a few more questions? Not at all. Wait a minute. How the fuck do you... People back then didn't just go often back and forth to France and the United States. That shit was definitely not often at all. Thus probably why it took 15 years to talk to Ladies, gentlemen, I bid you all good night. Mr. President, I mean, lady. Your Eminence, Duchess, you have the same rooms as usual. You, Monsieur de Richet, will find your room at the end of the corridor. I was sneaking into uh, Emily's room. We're gonna try to bang her. Well, my friends, I am. <laughs> Actually, we're sneaking into George Washington's room. We're gonna try to bang him. Bed. See you in the morning. Good night, sir. I shall do likewise. Louis, I shall see you in the morning. Sleep well. Oh, I'm peeping Good night. on you. See you tomorrow. Oh, man. It's been quite a day. Right. Where is my room? Duchess Emily Hillsborough. Ah, uh, won't let me go in there. <laughs> right. So what shall I do with this letter? It might be about my I'm mother's disappearance. I'm fucking reading it. But if I open it, I'll be betraying Biagi's trust. What should I do? Open the letter, I'll break and seal, unseal the letter, leave the letter closed. Man, okay, let's shell. see what he break contains. His trust. Too bad for Biagi. So... It really is a list of French countrymen. Piaggi wasn't lying. Uh, maybe we should have. But now it's opened. I better get it to mother soon. I had enough of this game for today. If you guys want to see more of it, let me know in the comments below. Um, that concludes uh, Story Driven Sunday. Yeah, this is gonna be a new series that we do here. Uh, while we contemplate jumping off this cliff. But anyway, guys, if you want to see more, let me know in the comments below. I love every single one of you. Until next time, my fellow sea serpents. Bye.